Why is this $3? Save yourself $3. Go spend that $3 on a bag, okay? I want all the things. Do you feel that way when you're at Target Dollar Spot? Keep $5 for that? Nah, put it back. Beach, please. If you've got any spare money, spend it here. And then this, $10? I don't remember anymore. My memory is like a squirrel. I'm a steal alert. I don't know what that is. I thought maybe a stomach. I want all of those pillows, but really, they're just gonna, if I bought them, I would leave them outside and they would get moldy. I am braving the elements for you guys. It is pouring rain, but I'm still gonna go to Target. Hello people, I just got done shopping at my second Target because that's how dedicated I am. I went to the Target dollar spot at my local Target and they're renovating things and not everything was out and it was kind of like misplaced everywhere. So I did film all of that and then since I feel like I left out on some things, I missed out on some things, I went to the Super Target that's a little bit farther away from me. I love you guys. And um, I found some things that my Target didn't have. And this, I should have just gone to this Target initially. Next time, remind, remind me to just do that because this Target's amazing and everything is just organized and lovely. But needless to say, I went to Target because I love it. And they have so many new things at the Target dollar spot. So let's shop together and die over all of the amazing stuff. Let's go. Okay, guys, I'm so excited to share this with you. Buckle up. It's a long one. First thing we're going to look at uh, is some summer stuff. I'm so excited. Okay, so those are glass bottles that you can pour whatever you want into. Um, those, I actually bought one of those. Should I do a haul and show you what I got? Um, like a utensil slash uh, plate holder. And then, oh my gosh, I'm going so fast already. But this video is so long, so I need to talk faster. These green jars, what the heck would you use them for, guys? What would you put in them? I have no idea. I'm thinking... Uh, I don't know, rocks? <laughs> Okay, so those are like little appetizer plates. Adorable, of course. These pineapples, everyone's raving about them, but I don't understand why. Those little, um, those are little things that you can put on cups to decipher like which cup is whose. I love that idea. And then moving along, straws and what is that? A little bottle skirt, a koozie. Um, this is the gardening section over here. So those are like little twinkly lights, which I think is adorable. And then these like fake cement little uh, like candle holders or you can put jewelry in there or really whatever you want. What are you going to put in there? Same thing as you put in the green glass jars, I guess. I have no idea. Whatever you want. Hidden treasures. And then these are really adorable too. These like su fake succulent, they're like glass ceramic. Um, you can put your jewelry rings in there. I think they're adorable. And then those are little fake succulents and then the candles for $5, which $5 for a candle I think is a really good deal. And then these are outdoor pillows. A pineapple a, a day keeps the worries away. Love that. And then the Friggin' flamingos, guys, always take the scenic route. I love that pillow, too. I want all of those pillows, but really, they're just gonna, if I bought them, I would leave them outside and they would get moldy. Okay, so a floaty for your cups. Is this necessary? Maybe it is if you like to live in the pool. These gardening sticks, oh my gosh, I wanted to buy them all, but then I thought, nah, I don't want to waste my money. Um, <laughs> I do regret not buying that, like, cactus little uh, decor piece. And then, as you can see, my target is a little empty. We're moving along, a little two cans and then I did go to the other Publix those gnomes I'm loving those gnomes as well and then hold on let's go back these things these are air pumps what do you use them for a bicycle uh, balloons I don't understand what they're used for and then these my goodness I was I wanted them so badly I wish they had them in adult sizes I would wear them that's how weird I am and then these um what else would you use them for? I know they're ice cube trays, the cactus, the flamingo, loving them. I don't know what that is. I thought maybe a stomach, but then I'm thinking real life. That's probably like a baby carriage or something. <laughs> I don't know. Um, and then these little play guns or whatever they are, water shooters. And then these, oh my gosh, you can keep your seeds all together in a little tin organizing set. <sighs> Guys, recipe tins are old news garden seed tins. That's the new thing. I'm loving it. I think those were $3 and that is a deal for a tin. <laughs> you can store whatever you want in them. These towels, I'm loving them. I definitely bought one of those. Um, this one says, oh, I forgot, but I did buy it. It's a flamingo one. This one says beach, please. And then tropical vibes. And then that shark one at the bottom, that one's really cute too. I didn't notice that when I was in the store. And here's more gardening stuff. 
Guys, the stuff at Target Dollar Spot, as per the huge, is adorable. Um, and then, you know, the garden stakes, the garden windows. W- actually, what is that? Just a decor piece? I don't know. My garden, it's not fancy. I should jazz it up, but mm, whatever. Uh, these little bird houses, those are adorable too. These garden stones, guys. <laughs> I don't remember planning this. That is my life. And then uh, never enough time. And then this next one was my absolute fave. It says free weeds. <laughs> That's for sure. And these, okay, these don't have holes on the bottom of them. They're just little um, like flower pot holders. They are really cute, but they don't have holes. So like you'd have, well, I don't know how you would work that out. And I, oh, I regret not buying one of these because I need to hang something in my kitchen and that would be perfect. I think that was three or five dollars. Do I pick it up? I sure do. It's five dollars, which is a deal. All right, what else do this garden section offer us? Oh, those little baby hose and shovels. That's a steal. And then if you want to plant some herbs for your garden and some watering pots, you know what? I just use my hose. I don't know. Does that make me lazy or make me save money? <laughs> I don't know. Here's some gardening boxes right there. And then this section looks so pretty. Again, it's bare, but you can tell, you can get the gist of what it's supposed to look like. And at the other Target, they had more uh, more of a selection, so I'll definitely show you that as well. But um, I assume this is like for weddings or, you know, babies, help us capture the moment, like a baby shower or wedding shower, bridal shower, whatever. And then they have these wooden discs that you can just put anything on. And then these glasses with straws and lids, $3 for two of them, steal alert and this tissue paper three dollars I mean you can go to the dollar store and get some but it wouldn't be that pretty I'll tell you that right now and then some gift bags these cake holders these cake stands five dollars they always go super fast they had three different colors and a couple different styles I thought they were really pretty and then this section I assume is like the Mother's Day section although they didn't have that much to choose from these like again this like mirrored sign I don't understand them but I don't know um, one of them said mom the others had hearts and then these uh, wooden arrows sweets and treats I know where I can hang that in my bedroom and my kitchen and my living room dining room <laughs> I'm just kidding. drinks and then sweets and treats they had a couple of different sayings and then moving along some lip balms these necklaces were super cute too it's uh it says sisters and then that key that random lonely keychain and then they had a necklace that said mom I thought that was really sweet and for three dollars that's a cute necklace uh these candles were also three dollars and they smelled pretty good and the smell was actually the scent was pretty strong these mugs I've been seeing everyone pick them up um n- not necessarily the heart ones but they have a different uh style as well and those bottles uh not the bottles the jars I guess bottle whatever they uh, were glass so that's a good deal and then those little bags those handbags were three bucks I don't know I thought that was a little bit of a ripoff and then those bigger baskets and these they look like makeup bags oh my gosh so I think that's a deal I think they were five dollars but total uh, deal alert and then those uh, buckets and it comes with a shovel for a dollar can't beat that I always pick some up for the summertime even though uh, my garage is like overflowing with sand toys uh, and then I just showed you a couple more sand toys and summer toys the chalk paint the what is this sand sand something I can't read it play sand yes and it actually comes with some like you know how play-doh has like moldable things you can do that with that like kinetic sand and all that stuff Okay, and then lists. I really, I almost bought a couple of these. I put them on my fridge and then just tear off a page every time I need to jot something down. Um, and I almost bought a couple, but I'm still trying to go through my Valentine's Day ones. I just got done with my Christmas ones, so I'm going to hold off until next season. Uh, some sunglasses for a dollar, kid size, you can't beat that. And then this, a tie-dye. Oh my gosh, it's a shirt kit with four colors of tie-dye and then a shirt. Is the shirt included? I don't know. I didn't check, but you should check. For $5, you you can't beat that. You go to Michael's, you easy spend $20 on the same kind of kit. Uh, yeah, so I thought that was a deal. And then the, they have these inflatable ring toss games. I picked one up if you saw my Target haul. I think I had a cactus. That one was, I don't remember anymore. My memory is like a squirrel. Okay, and then these bags for $5. How much stuff can you throw in that bag? Use it as a gym bag. Use it as a beach bag. Use it as a travel bag, whatever you want to do. Use it as a cooler. Um, 
Yeah, but they had uh, a few different styles, and I just thought, like, they're humongo, so you can throw anything in there. I definitely bought one of them. And then these canvas-style bags, I think these were $3, um, and they were much smaller than the ones that I just showed, but they are canvas, so I don't know if the quality is better. Uh, oh, they're $3, and the other ones were 5 Whatever. Dinosaurs, cute prints. There's uh, sharks and fish and all that kind of stuff. Great little beach bags for the kiddos. And then they had this infant blanket. Oh, I'm on the floor. Floor. that was so cute and then if you're doing like a gender reveal they had it's a girl it's a boy little poppers I assume streamers are going to fly out of there with certain colors pink blue and then they had some bibs some uh, wooden letters uh, Mr. Mrs. Baby and that kind of thing uh, and then this ten dollars oh that's a little steep for the target section can I just say target dollar spot you got me there ten dollars really for a little bag like that? I don't know whatever moving along to the pencils the um flamingos and the pineapples were getting everyone real excited okay especially me myself included um and then these water bottles guys i i i, I scrolled through too quickly um bubble wands and then some more bubble blasters this was three bucks i easily spent like ten dollars on the one that i bought last year and then some more uh water balloon kind of things water toys but going back to the bunch of balloons that was such a deal you just hook it up to your hose and it does like a hundred water balloons all at once oh it takes the mess and crazy work out of it um and then those flying discs i don't really know what those are i've never i never played with those as a child but i'm sure your children might love them and then this a whole section of like summer toys that will eventually end up either broken or in the garbage i don't know if you want to waste your money on here this is the section to waste your money actually the whole dollar spot section is the section to like just throw your money away if you've got any spare money spend it here <laughs> that's how i feel about the target dollar spot um yeah so more things to write okay and and then more summer stuff oh my gosh so uh, it's just uh, I love summer bucket hats three dollars deal deal steal uh it's wonderful ice cream dinosaurs whatever mermaids and then these ten dollar bags again guys um no stay away from why would you spend ten dollars spend it elsewhere and then those mermaid tails were actually really cute oh here is a bag three dollars guys you can buy your, this bag for three dollars and then shove all the stuff all the junk that you buy at the target dollar spot in this three dollar bag it's amazing just do it oh and those mermaid tails one of them was like blue and kind of glittery i thought they were really cute um i can't remember the price but i'm sure i showed it and then uh just some more like pool toys here that you could float on mermaid vibes and then the shark whatever fun to play with and then this thing got me going I have no idea what this was a towel some kind of like mat that you lay, lay I guess like a beach uh towel like sheet that you put down on the sand that's what I'm assuming I don't know it comes with its own handle if you're into that and then these wet bags this is what I came for and I'm excited that I found them but uh the prints were kind of limited <sighs> whatever I did note it. They are $3 each. Did they just look at all the bags and say, mm, all the bags, $3? Well, wait a minute. Some of these are small. Some are bigger. Nope. All the bags, $3. Because <laughs> some of them are really small and still $3. It blows my mind. Okay. And then if you want to play like, oh, crud, what is this called? Badminton? No. Checkers? I'm just kidding. I don't remember what that game is called. Uh, tennis, kind of, with the little ball. And then uh, I just went over that way too quickly. This is my new Target dollar spot, if you're interested in seeing that. And then I also found some bath fizzies for a dollar. Yes, that is how much they should be priced. And then some finger paint for the bath. Uh, and then some washcloths and stuff. But I saw in someone else's haul that they had, like uh proper like uh you know adult looking bath bombs for a dollar which is what they should be priced okay okay and this is at the a bigger the super target beach please i found some more um wet bags or i mean you can throw anything you want in these bags beach bags whatever keep your stuff sand free and wet free whatever but i would i can throw like wet stuff in there to keep it uh, you know separated from everything else and then I found um, a flamingo which I didn't show oh and then these food picks this target dollar spot had so many more options and this little um, spatula well it's not a spatula the tongs they were really hard to manipulate so I don't know if it gets easier over time or if I just have really weak hands which is likely okay and then this section more succulents we went over most of it see those green and and clear jars at the bottom what would you put in them I still don't know and then the tray at the bottom uh the pillows these um succulents and then these leaves what 
They're pretty cool, but I don't know what you would do with them. Decorate, obviously. Hang them on your wall or in a vase or something. These picture frames were actually really cute as well. And $3, the quality was amazing uh, for the price. And then more string lights. I'm not into that. I don't know. Um, oh, and then this. It's like a, the window paint. Then you can put a picture in it for Mother's Day. And then it's another $3 bag. And then here's some more stationary kits. Um, I think these are $3 a piece because it comes with a bag. <laughs> I don't know what else. And then this watering can. Oh my gosh, this makes me not want to use my hose. A flamingo watering can. But it was a little steep. $5 for that. Nah, put it back. And then those napkins. They had a bunch of napkins that were a dollar a piece. Well, a dollar for a pack. And then, guys, the flamingo print. Is it driving you crazy? It's amazing. Those plastic, those bo water bottles were plastic, but I think they were $3. And then these lunch, not lunch, these uh, coolers, um, $5. Guys, that's a great price for a cooler. And it um, it's rectangle. There's no like weird shape to it. Oh my gosh, I feel like I could fit so much stuff in there. And then if you are, you know, have a little extra money to spend, this little tote bag here was $7. And I think it would be really fancy if you're not packing for a family of five. You know what I mean? Don't need all that extra space. If you're just, you know, going to the beach by yourself. Does that happen? I don't know. It's not in my world, okay? Not my season of life. Here's some socks. Five socks for three bucks. Is that the deal? Guys, blowing my mind. Um, and then more flamingos, a big canvas flamingo bag. How much is this bag? I bet you $3. It might be five though. <laughs> Watch it be five. Um, a pineapple on the canvas bag. Tropic like it's hot. I love when they, uh, you know, change the words like that. Uh, don't hassle me. I'm local. I like that one too. Oh, and beach hats. Beach, please. Uh, well, you can wear these hats anywhere. Beach hair. Don't care. I love that one. Flamingos on that one. A pineapple. All kinds of hats. Uh, and then more gardening stuff. Those gloves. Again, gardening boxes. This would be really good for parties. Anything you want to put in there. Drinks, ice, whatever. And then the, those garden hats. I am kicking myself that I did not get one because they are adorable and I can put my hair up in a bun. You know what I mean? Man, I can go running in that hat. I can go shopping in that hat. I want all those hats. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to go back and get some. And this is what I was talking about earlier um, that they didn't have at my Target. This is so stinking cute. One side is hello and then all the birth stats. And then on the other side is a chalkboard that you can erase and do like every month. Like, you know, oh, I'm into this and I have this many teeth. I just thought that was adorable. And then more chalk stuff. Those mini chalkboards would be great for like parties if you entertain a lot. Oh my gosh, my my heart was like, oh, I want all of this stuff. But my wallet was like, put Kim, put it down, okay? Um, and then this is like their office supply section. I wanted to buy that really badly, but then I thought, oh my gosh, the color just... I don't know how to decorate, so I just didn't think it would look good. Um, and then this, a whole section of like um, car travel, like stuff to keep you busy or occupied in the car. Well, not you, but your kids or I don't know, maybe you are a kid. Stuff to keep you busy in the car. Well, maybe not the paint, but like this bingo, road trip bingo. Oh, that, those are so cool. And they had multiple different options. And um, yeah, I'm my fingers are weak, like I said earlier. So you can just slide it over. You don't need like bingo chips or anything. What an invention. OK, that is amazing. I was like looking at them for 20 minutes. Move along, Kim. OK, this felt food. Uh, there's a pie. There's some mores. Hello. I I am in love with the, all the felt food. I have so much felt food for my kids. They like never play with it. I think I play with it more than they do. Or I clean it up and organize it. Anyway, moving along. A dinosaur felt book. And then they have a mermaid felt book. These are just good like busy kits to give your kids if they're in the car or, you know, it's, you know, they're growing out of nap time and you just need like quiet time. And then they have all these kits. Uh, travel art kit has like a pouch for things to color on and then a pouch to hold your crayons, markers, whatever. And then they have these learning felt kits. Felt is everywhere, okay? I love it. I don't hate it. And then this dinosaur, you can learn your colors. They had a picnic thing. Oh, and then moving on to the baby stuff. Look at those socks and they get bigger. Oh, they're so adorable. And then these wooden blocks that you can track um, the baby's weeks, months. You can even do this during your pregnancy. Put it next to your belly and take pictures and stuff. I thought that was adorable. So they have a whole section for like babies and bridal shower and stuff like that. Back to the summer kids stuff. They have a stamping set. What is this? Mermaids. What does that say? Oh, it's like a like foam stickers. And then these watches. I think they were three bucks. What a great deal for a watch. I feel like 
I don't know. I spent way too much money on my watch. I mean, it does a lot, but come on. Uh, these markers, m moving along, stencils, all this kind of stuff. Guys, are you still with me? It's been almost 19 minutes. Can't believe you made it this far. But the good stuff is yet to come. Well, maybe some of the good stuff, okay? It's, it's not over yet. And then more art supplies. This kit was $5, a stationary kit. They had two different kinds. I feel like my kids would love this. And then on the other spectrum, I'm like, they have all of this stuff. It's just not in a kit. You know what I mean? And then more shovels, buckets, sand toys, balls, uh, you know, play toys. Oh, and this is a hack. If you're going to Disney this summer, go to Target and get stuff from Target rather than buying it like at Disney store or, you know, at Disney you save so much money. These hats were three bucks. Oh my gosh. I wanted to buy some, but I don't know if they're going to fit my kids' heads. So <laughs> got to try them out. And then more. This is like a planning section if you're into planners or journals or whatever. They had so many stickers. Uh, well, the bottles aren't really for planning. Oh, look at this bag. Three bucks. I told you. And it's, it's like the size of my hand. I, I mean, it's good for like whatever, if you need to separate stuff, markers, pencils, pens. Um, I, I love all the bags. Oh, look, there is a bath bomb. Look at that. I missed it on the left there. I bet you that's only a dollar or so I saw in someone else's Target haul. These candles, three bucks. Bath bomb, a dollar. What? And then the jar to the left right there, a glass jar. What? That is so cute. You could store like pen, not pens, but like uh, paper clips, stuff like that, tacks. Okay. And then moving on to this, dry erase boards. I need like a dry erase board for like chores for my kids kids or like to-do lists in the morning. I feel like, well, maybe they would just wipe it off. Anyway, these bins, $3, wait, were they $3 or $5? I don't remember. I think they were three, but what a deal. I wanted to buy them all, but then I thought, oh my gosh, I don't know where I'm going to put them. I want all the things. Do you feel that way when you're at Target Dollar Spot, Bullseye Playground, whatever it's called? And then all of that stuff for your journal too, stickers and pads and notebooks. And uh, what is this? Note cards. Oh my gosh. And then those notepads to the left, those ink pads. Guys, there's so many options. I can't get over it. Boss notes, three bucks for that a little, Not it's not quite a trapper keeper, but it's like a folder inside and a notepad. Oh, I wanted to die over these. These are so cute for the garden. I don't know. I'm not fancy enough to have like a, a, a thing, a pad for my knee, a knee pad. Is that what they're called? But if I was fancy enough for that, I would definitely get one of these gardening is cheaper than therapy well I'm not sure about that well it probably yeah therapy is pretty expensive who said there's nothing free in life have you seen the weeds in my garden okay and then another cactus one three dollars for those God, oh my gosh Ugh. and then those pineapple shells everyone was going crazy over those okay I think this is the last section more beach play things footballs for three bucks that you you know you just throw balls on the beach and then this oh my gosh this brings me back to my childhood I played that every time I went to the beach I want to say so I definitely got one of those so my kids can enjoy some of my old school memories as well foam shooters uh that's a deal three dollars what it's like a nerf gun nerf guns are like a hundred dollars and then these bags oh my gosh were they three dollars i didn't see i bet they were <laughs> i bet they weren't maybe i'm just saying that these were five dollars for goggles but if you go to the dollar store hello you're gonna save yourself four dollars um and then these little pegboards, one was colors, one was dinosaurs, one is numbers, and then there was like fish and sharks on another one. There's some more dinosaurs to play with. And okay, what else? What else? Oh, these pads. Okay. They have um, crayons in them and a notepad, notepad, and that's it. Uh, what? And I tried to look around and it comes with a pouch. I was like, why is this $3? Save yourself $3. What? You're paying $3 for crayons and a blank notepad. What? Yes. Go spend that $3 on a bag, okay? And then they had chutes and ladders. They had hangman. These are like magnetic uh, toys. You'd use them in the car, busy, you know, that kind of thing. And then checkers. What? That is so cool if you want little pieces of junk all over the bottom of your car <laughs> or in your carpet, whatever. Oh, and this, are you ready to have your mind blown? It's for a little cupcake, a little cupcake stand. Oh my gosh. So stinking cute. And then very last thing that I'm going to show you, I think, are these hats that I found. These are really cute. Again, they're not bucket hats. They're like normal hats. Did I already show you some of these? I feel like these are different prints. The flamingos. And then um, I don't really know what that is. A, a crocodile face with sunglasses. <laughs> and then a shark. And that looks like a pig. But I have, I don't have, maybe that's what a flamingo face looks like. I don't know. And if you're interested in seeing my Target, holy crap, looks like a department store. There's a little pan of it for you. It's blowing my mind. But thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Holy crud. It's been 24 minutes almost. I appreciate your time. I will not take up any more of it. So I will see you next time. Bye.